Yo, what's going on YouTube and welcome back to another Destiny Taken King video. And in this video, I want to show you guys another brand new exotic. This is the Tychonaut, an exotic helmet for the Titans. But just look at it, it makes you look like an astronaut, it is so flipping awesome. And if you guys do like this helmet or you enjoy this video, then it'd be really awesome if you could leave a like. Now, just before I get into the actual video itself, I want to give a massive shout out to Callum Shell on Twitter, who very kindly let me record some footage of this on his Titan. He got this in a nightfall, and thanks to him, I can now show you guys exactly what this does. So make sure you hit him up with a follow on Twitter, I'll leave a link to it in the description box down below. But what does this do? Well first up, the description for this helmet reads, The helmet worn by the first Chinese lunar colonists of the Golden Age. Again, it comes with a base 290 defence, and the perks are as follows. First up, the intrinsic perk is air traffic control. All rocket launchers gain tracking, radar remains visible while zooming with heavy weapons, and heavy ammo drops increase when using a rocket launcher. Again, you have the ability to infuse, and you can then increase your intellect or your discipline. Moving on from there, you then have Inverse Shadow, which gives you increased super energy gained from killing minions of the darkness, and you then have Heavy Lifting, where you can gain bonus super energy from heavy weapon kills on minions of the darkness. And then finally, in the last column, you have Infusion, replenish health each time you pick up an orb of light. So, they are the main perks, and once again, if we take a look at this, you can see this really is absolutely awesome. The only one bad thing about this helmet is that it doesn't actually change colour with the shader. This is one of those ones where, when you switch shaders, it remains exactly as it is. So if you do want to kind of match your armour, you're probably going to want to find a matching shader. But either way, that is how it looks. But if we quickly jump over to the game world, you can see this in action. So first of all, you can see here, I've got a rocket launcher. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to switch helmets so I'm not wearing the Tycho Nort. You can see that now when I zoom in, there's no tracking noise indicator. And if I fire the rocket near the enemy, it goes straight past them. However, if I then put the helmet back on, you can instantly hear the noise that indicates it's actually tracking and locking on. And if I then move the reticle slightly away from the enemy, fire the rocket, you can see it does indeed home in on them. And this, this is the rocket launcher I'm using, just to kind of verify that it doesn't actually have tracking with it. You can see here, it does obviously have grenades and horseshoes, but it doesn't have tracking in any way, shape or form. So the tracking comes exclusively from the exotic helmet, which means you can then turn any rocket launcher into a potential demon. This is a really good helmet to have, and I can imagine it being a really good thing to wear with that new exotic rocket launcher. Either way, that is it for this video. That is the Tycho Nort. Again, a massive shout out to Callum Shell for letting me record this. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Thanks again for watching. Take it easy. Catch you next time. Peace out.